Guys, I bring you a new world video showcasing all known legendary rapiers in the game. I will mention a lot of these weapons haven't been obtained yet by anybody, as well as some of the images of these weapons are placeholders. But in terms of the weapons, stats, etc, etc, it's all here. So let's go. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so in this video, I'll showcase you all known legendary rapiers in the game and how they're obtained. Now, like I said, some of the images are placeholders and some of the weapons haven't been found yet. So maybe you guys can help me out with one or two of these things once you get them, that is. So let's get into it. And firstly, guys, we have the final spite. So this legendary is an end game expedition drop from various of the enemies within them. So the depths, the garden of Genesis and the Lazarus instrumentality expeditions will have you covered in getting this one. Next up guys, you have the sacred wood saber. So this like the last sword is also a legendary that is tied to the various end game expeditions. Again, the depths, the garden of Genesis and the Lazarus instrumentality. These will have you covered for this sword. Next up guys, we have the Swan Sunk. So this legendary is an Outpost Rush Tier 5 Cash Chess Reward. Obviously you need to be a level 60 to take part in this basically PvP style 20v20 mode. But yes, this drops from the end chest. Next up guys, we have the Sirens Marketo. Now this is a world drop across the board. Obviously a certain level is required before you will see this drop. And I believe that level may be around 40 to 50, but don't quote me on that. Next up guys, we have the Putrid Fishbone. This again is also a world drop across the board. Again, I believe you need to be around a level 40 before you'll start seeing any of these legendaries drop. Next up guys, we have Motherwell Wishes Wand. Again, like the last two, this is a world drop across the board. Again, it's believed you need to be around that level of 40 before this can drop. Next up guys, we have the last hope. This like one other weapon within this list is unknown at the moment. No one knows where this drops. So if you do know where this drops, please let me know and I'll add it to the video description. Next up guys, we have the phase covenant. This again is a world drop across the board and it's believed you need to be at a level 40 or more for this to drop. Next up we have another world drop and it's the Atlas Killer. Again across the board guys this weapon can drop when that certain level is required which is believed to be a level 40. Next up guys you have the Assassination Blade. This as well as the Last Hope is unknown at the moment. No one knows where this is obtained. So if you know if you're watching this within a month from this video being uploaded and you know you've had this drop let me know and I'll add it to the video description. Next up guys, we have the Spirit of Oblivion. This is a quest reward. The quest giver is Jewish Hereif. The territory is Shad Mountain and the quest name is Blight Resistance. Basically, you have to collect a Blight sample from the Hidden Strain and defeat Faye, the last protector. Bring a piece of the remains back to the NPC in Shad Mountain and this should be the reward. Okay, so lastly guys, we have the Voidbringer's Rapier. This weapon needs to be crafted. That trade skill needs to be weapon smithing. Required stations, obviously a blacksmith tier 5. Weapon smithing level needs to be a 200. The trade skill XP is around that 5,150 mark. And the territory standing needs to be a level 99. And there we have it guys. All known legendary rapiers in the game so far. If I've missed a legendary, please let me know down below in the comment section. Like I said, if you can help me out with some of the ones that are not known about yet, please do. And like I said, I edit the video description. But yes, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. We'll have a video for every weapon type coming today and tomorrow. So check out my channel if there's a specific weapon type you want to know more about. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Subscribe for more New World. And hopefully I will see you on that next one.